Hey, hey, you guys, it's Christina from the Purple Alphabet, and I stumbled on Pinterest across this little experiment from onetimethrough.com. And what was great about this is that it only took a couple of cupboard items in my kitchen to make it. It's really simple. All you're gonna need is a glass container. I had this old glass jar, it's kinda dirty. You need some popping corn, you know, the kind that you would use to make popcorn. You're gonna need some water, about two and a half to three cups, two tablespoons of baking soda, and six tablespoons of white vinegar. And you can also use food coloring, it's optional. So really easy here, guys. All you're gonna do is put the water into your glass container, add your food coloring if you wanted to make it a different color. I added my baking soda and I stirred it pretty well. This is with a chopstick because it's the only thing I had that was long enough. And just make sure all the baking soda is dissolved. Next, take a handful of your popcorn and just drop it right into your container. And then you add the vinegar and watch the corn start to hop up and down. Not only is this mesmerizing for the little ones, but it's also an introduction to science. They can also help measure and pour in all of the ingredients so they can help you and be on your side doing that. If your children are interested, you can start introducing a little bit of talk about you know, how gases work. So basically when you mix the baking soda and the vinegar, they combine and then they make together carbon dioxide, so CO2 gas. And it's the gas that makes the bubbles and the bubbles is what surrounds the kernels and makes them go all the way up to the top and then all the way back down again. This little experiment will last a while so you can watch the popcorn go up and down and up and down many times. You can even make different colored jars with different colored water and make a rainbow of popcorn if you wanted to. But really, it's just a fun activity to do with your kids. Simple and easy and you have the items already. Click subscribe to see more videos like this. Give me a thumbs up to show your love and let me know in the comments if you plan on doing this. This. I'd love to hear ties and hair clips so I organized them by color um, the little hair ties in one section these are the kind we use